Hey guys, I'm Ali. If you're looking forward to upgrade your PC, well, make sure you watch the whole video. I had a Core 2 Duo PC with 2GB of RAM and a Seagate 500GB hard disk and no graphic card. As the time passed by, it got pretty slow, hanged all the time even when I was surfing on the internet. Then I realized it was time for an upgrade. I had a budget for 20,000 for upgrading my PC. Thanks to my friend Rohit, it, I was possible to upgrade my PC under my budget. My priority was heavy multitasking and running heavy softwares like Sony Vegas Pro, Adobe Photoshop, etc. There are 6 essential things to keep in mind while upgrading your PC. The SMPS, the motherboard, the processor, RAM, the cabinet and the hard disk. Well, for the processor, I chose the Intel i3 processor 6098P. The 6th generation processor is the latest one and comes with the stock cooler inside the box. There is the warranty statement. For the motherboard, we went with the Gigabyte H100M S22 motherboard. Here's the motherboard itself. Here's the two SATA cables in the box. They, and also they have included a user's manual inside the box. It supports DDR3 as well as DDR4 RAM. For the input output ports, there is a PS2 keyboard and mouse ports, a VGA port, two USB 3.0, two USB 2.0, a LAN RJ45 port and these three is for the audio and the microphone. For the RAM, we went with the HyperX Fury DDR4 8GB of RAM. The box includes the RAM itself and a manual and a HyperX sticker. As compared to DDR3, DDR4 consumes less power. My friend Rohit helped me assembling my PC and made it up. I used the same SMPS, the cabinet and HDD of my old PC. i3 processor, the motherboard and the RAM cost me only 15,000 bucks as compared to Amazon which cost around 18,000 bucks. And if you're sort of a gamer, you can invest in a decent entry level graphic card which will cost you around 6 to 7,000 rupees. After installing the OS, don't forget to install the drivers from the CD included with the motherboard. And don't get me wrong guys, the performance is more than what I expected. It can handle casual games without any lag. At resolution of 1600 by 900. So that's it guys for the video. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked what you saw, please leave a like to the video. Till then, peace out.